Our referee tonight is Greg Romero giving the final instructions to these two young ladies. Honey Punch Kyle is in the pink. The Boss Frost wearing black. This one looks like fun, Eric. This does look good. This should be an interesting matchup. Slate size advantage for the Boss. Both fighters making their LFC debut tonight. I enjoyed talking to Serena Kyle before this fight. She is a sweet young lady who looks to put on a fantastic performance tonight. And you can see the aggression right away. Honey Punch has an interesting style. So just charge right in. Oh, look at that trip there. Fantastic technique, putting the brawler on her back. And she takes her back. Moving to the back right away. Great stuff there. The smaller employee, or excuse me, the smaller <laughs> fighter. Scrambles up to her feet there. Had the back momentarily, but couldn't get anything on that. Oh, oh. the spinning back fist. Missed on that technique, and you can see Maxine the Boss Frost took advantage of it. She timed that takedown perfectly. Slipped right underneath that spinning back fist. Beautiful yes. takedown here. The grappling of Honey Punch Kyle has been fantastic to start out. Swept again. The Boss Frost will not stay on her back. The more powerful fighter now, the brawler on top. And just shoves the legs out of the way, wants to get back to the feet. I think that's where Maxine wants this fight to take place. She loves to brawl. And look at the running attacks for Honey Punch <laughs> Kyle. I love the tenacity. Seeing a slight strength advantage for the boss and a little more speed coming from Honey Punch. Yeah, it really does look like the speed it is with Kyle, but oh, look at, can she get a standing choke? No, falls off there on the standing guillotine choke. She seems like her face or something. There. Yeah, maybe someone bothered her there. Referee gonna come over and take a look. Not sure exactly what happened there. Was going for the standing choke attempt, was not able to get the finish. Maxine Frost. Known not to necessarily follow the rules at all times. May have been something a little dirty there that we didn't catch on our first look. She's been known to dirty box, especially up against the cage like that. Looks like we're going to carry on. You can see right away Serena Kyle with the aggression. Again, the speed in and out of range. And she's going for a hip toss here. When she gets in tight, this has been the tough part. I think Maxine Frost has dominated in these types of exchanges. I think Serena Kyle wants to pull away. And use that speed that way. Oh! It was just a matter of time, but she nailed that. Wow. Gosh, look at the scrambling though from Serena Kyle. She's now on top. She gets thrown on her back and is now in the mount position. But as soon as I say it, now it's Maxine Frost. The boss has some really nice sweeps, and she's been utilizing them well in this fight. Wow, what an incredible turn of events. The grappling exchange between these two. And Serena Kyle now looking for the Kimura. That's her signature technique, but could not get it done in time. It looks like that's the end of the first one. Let's take a look at the replay. Look at the spinning back fist there. She ducked under it perfectly. And here was the moment where something went wrong. Not exactly sure what happened there. There was a beautiful slam to the floor. Maxine Frost, powerful. Okay, sit up straight, breathe in. Deep breaths, deep breaths, we're gonna bring you back down. Okay, how are you feeling? Good, it was a good round. Pretty close around, I could have gone either way, so. Some of this crap happened, it's ridiculous. I didn't do anything. You know? How you feeling, you wind good? No, I'm good, yeah. Okay, good. All right, let's get out, we're ready to go. Underway, and you see right away Serena Kyle rushing forward. A little bit of a slip there back to her feet. Now, hobbling a little bit. Maybe that's back to what happened in round one. Yeah, it looks like she's hurt her ankle. 
Still looking to fight the spinning kick there. <laughs> Incredible. Doesn't seem to be slowing her down too much. This reminds me of Jamie Varner. Just the, the, the leg injury maybe, but still fighting on. Can't she find some type of miracle? Looking for the choke there, not gonna happen. Back inside and away. She needs to get this uh, fight to the ground and get off her ankle for a little bit and try to let it heal up. Yeah, Serena Kyle, there's something wrong there, but look at the heart here. And now slipping around to the back. Well, she's got How did she get in. that position? The left arm briefly under the neck, but no. She stayed on top. Why? And now she's going for the kimura. The signature hold is locked in. She's got it in tight. Can't get the finish, though. They say she sometimes lacks the killer technique. We saw there. And now it's Maxine Frost going for the arm bar. She gets it. Wow. What an incredible turn of events. Serena Kyle, obviously hobbling, looked like she had her signature move set up to get the miracle finish. Instead, Maxine Frost escapes the hole and gets an arm bar of her own. Wow. She was so close, and then in that one instant, the boss took over. And you can see the disappointment on her face. Obviously, something is wrong with the knee or the ankle there, not in the quarter weight. Let's take a look at the replay here. The running techniques of Serena Kyle, so fun to watch, but you can see as she falls to the ground, something was wrong. Yeah, she slipped right on her ankle. And here was the ending sequence there. Looked like she had to fall down, rear naked choke, got into a Kimura, but fell to the arm bar here from Maxine Frost. And there's the tab. Fantastic. Yeah. She'll be okay. All right. Hot tub, yeah. one pill. Did you start your knee? Okay, yeah. we'll get you like that. She'll be all right, she'll be okay. You stuck to your game plan, and that's why you're getting in the game. I got you, here, No. And you can see a little bit of support there from the referee knowing uh, the injury that she went through, incredible performance.